Hi there, my name's Sally Ann Meller. I'm course director of postgraduate studies in law, and I have a particular interest in environmental law and agricultural law. That's certainly where my PhD study focus is. I'm here to talk to you about Sustainable Gastronomy Day. A bit of a mouthful, yeah. Um, and really just to highlight what it's all about. So the day is used to celebrate where your food crumb comes from. So thinking about how, it, you know, the destination it's gone through, the process it's gone through to actually reach your plate. Um, and, you know, culinary, um, um, professionals are going to be celebrating this across the across the world raising awareness of of your you know food to fork in, a, in essence so your where the process your food has come from to reach your plate and really for you to consider um, how sustainable the food you're eating is so consider um, what's on your plate um, and consider the journey it's it's undergone and undertaken to actually you know reach you uh, and what the impact might have on you know the carbon footprint um, and the impact this could have um, from a, a, a global perspective um, and really to be sustainable we need to be considering um, supporting um, local farmers local producers and limit you know sort of reducing that um, journey that travel and the impact that will have on the carbon footprint so buy produce that's in season support your local farmers markets and your local butchers uh, and try and sort of think about the sustainability of food and also not wasting food as well perhaps reusing food that uh, is left over um, so hopefully you found that interesting and it's given you something to think about. Uh, certainly the mileage, um, it, you know, it's taken your food to reach your plate um, and the different processes it's gone through and, you know, what we can do to try and be more sustainable, uh, protecting the environment around us. Thank you.